Thousands of BWO customers will start seeing changes in their utility bills. Now, this all comes after BWO's Board of Commissioners decided to support a rate hike increase among utilities on Tuesday night. A plan to raise utility rates brought several neighbors to the BWL board meeting Tuesday night with concerns like these. How do you feel about these increases? They're unsustainable. They're exorbitant. They're unjustifiable. Despite the calls from our neighbors, BWL's Board of Commissioners decided to support the rate increases by a vote of 5 to 1, striking a nerve for residents like Loretta Stanaway. There are so many people right now who are struggling to even just keep the lights on that this will make the difference for them and they will up and pack and move out of town. Uh, for others, you know, they say, oh, $10 a month is a Starbucks. Well, no, it's a copay for a medican, medication. It's, it's another utility that they have to pay. It's their trash service for the month. BWL announced the proposed two-year increases a few weeks back, and they include about a 6% increase for electric, about a 9% increase for water, a 9.75% increase for steam, and about a 2% increase for chilled water. Um, not everybody can afford all these increases. Um, there's a lot of people that really do set out and work their butts off to survive, and this is one of them that's really putting a damper on us. So do I go out and buy food for the week, or do I pay my board of water and light bill this week? You know what I'm saying? It's, it's getting pretty hard for people. Over the next two years, BWL is expected to gain about $50 million in revenue from the increases, money that BWL's chief financial officer, Heather Shawa, says will be well spent. These rates are very um, important for not only keeping up and maintaining our operational costs, but also to support new and clean energy um, and other system improvements as well. Now we're told customers will start seeing changes in their bills on October 1st. For now, reporting here in front of the BWL's headquarters in Rio Town, I'm Larry Wallace, Fox 47 News.